Yep. I don't know how important this wood piece is right here. This one is somewhat deteriorated, but I don't know if it has any real value being in there or not. You could probably replace that, and if for nothing but looks purposes, it would probably look a lot better if I did replace it. The guy that I bought mine from said these things here always break, crack, and uh, I thought I'd have a look at this one. It isn't broken or cracked, but it does look like it's been welded up a bit. So, right up, you can see a weld right here. That's what I wind up doing at the one over I got out there, is kind of touching it up before I put one back on there. He had this bolt cross threaded. I don't suppose that matters because when I put mine back on, I won't be using that bolt. I'll be using. Uh, the one on that car outside. Take a look at this one here. And, uh, yeah, all pretty similar. Okay, so that's a big deal. Got the top off. I'm going to get these fenders off, take that bumper off. I'm going to take that door panel off over there. I've decided to leave the windows in it just because I don't want to have to keep up with all the little parts. But, uh, yeah so I guess the next thing after that will be unbolted from the body I'll go ahead and get these fenders and bumper off I think the next thing I want to do is pop the wheel pop the wheels off because I'm going to be wanting to get up under those fenders and everything and it probably makes sense just to push this thing forward and uh, have it have it be uh, sitting on the uh, on the lift when I do that. Uh, so, I'll do that. good place to start.